Uh, hello, uh, what's an empty yoder for a second there? Shalom, ni hao, bonjour, guten abends, bom dia, hola, uh, uh, it's uh, mahaba, <laughs> it's me, table, welcome, and we are now going to build ourselves a robot in this game called Robocraft. So, uh, oh, it's a Robocraft challenge as well. The Robocraft challenge is that, right, let's make sure I'm building it forwards first of all. There we go, okay. So we're building uh, a mech. And what we want to test is the challenge is can you build a mech capable of jumping? So we're going to do this and we're going to go uh, hardware. What are the carbon thrusters called nowadays? Movement. They are called cheetahs. Cheetah thrusters. Have I done that perfectly? No. Have I done this perfectly? Yeah. So we can put two cheetahs in there immediately. That's fantastic. I'm going to cut that off. So that's two cheetahs already in the chassis. Now to jump, we really need to uh, make sure that it's got a significant amount of upward thrust. Frosty's on, hey Frosty, I'll be with you soon, don't worry buddy. So I wanna make the back look kind of significant as well, but before we get too far ahead of ourselves, let's spare a moment for color, because I know white is a bit harsh on your eyes, so let's do gray. Bingo, uh, bingo, bango, bongos. Uh, let's go to prisms. So we're just gonna do that and this. I kind of like the idea of internalizing a couple of these thrusters. That appeals to me. Okay, so good, we've got those in. Uh, let's go. You know what, maybe this can be quite a, uh, quite a boxy mech maybe. You know, there's a lot of Hawken mechs that have jump capability. Really, if you're going to make something that can jump significantly, uh, you want it to be quite light, really, don't you? Or, you know, I assume you would. So let's do that and be really cheeky and then do this. Yeah, there we go. Changing up the the texture of the of the design. Yeah. All <laughs> right. Okay. There we go. Now, another thing with this jump capability is that I still want it to be able to fight, so I am going to arm it with the maximum amount of SMGs that I can equip. Uh, what did I just do there? What key did I press to cause that to happen? Hmm, mysterious. Good. I might leave those showing, actually. They look quite fancy. In fact, I might do this. Uh, this. You know, I might do that. I might go like this as well. Ah, now we're going, getting somewhere. Let's go like that. No, let's go more and do this. Yeah, there we go. Hmm. Now that is something that needs to be addressed. So let's go like that. And then, hmm, should I double it up? Yeah, I'm going to double it up. So then this will become... Uh, cosmetic, let's go to glass. Should we dare try bubbles? No. We're gonna go like this, and like this. Do you know what, maybe I always go too small with cockpits. Maybe I should do that. Maybe I should go like this. Is that too excessive? I kind of like it. I like the squat, the squat design so much so that I'm gonna go and get, go to my SMGs. And I'm, no, not a mega SMG, I can't. Wait, if it's a jump mech, I should go plasma devastator. Let's stick a plasma devastator right. Ah, oh, do you know what, I could go double devastator. Maybe I could get another de devastator there. No, okay, single devastator, right. Uh, do you know what, no, let's not put the extra block on. Let's have the devastator low down. Uh, devastator, bang. One devastator. So we've got a devastator. We need to do mech legs, uh, and we need uh, thrust, a lot of thrust. So let's start trying to mount on some more of these cheetahs. So we can get a cheetah there. Fantastic. Uh, I think error rods are going to be my friends in this. Oh, I really like what I've made. I don't want to ruin it. <laughs> so let's go. Let's go down. We're gonna have to go down a certain amount. Let's go. Oh. Okay, let's get these legs on. So I think something like that is gonna be fine. Uh, movement, mech leg, Colossus. 
two Colossus. Hmm. Is that now? Is that because I, my design is too low, or because they're too near? Ah, my days. The legs are huge. They are absolutely massive legs, Colossus. Bang. Okay, so there. So I can go up one without too much of a problem. So let's do that. Delete those out. Legs, Colossus. In you go. So there we have it. That's our uh, mech looking sufficiently uh, not how I wanted. <laughs> so let's go like so. Uh, I'm just going to leave that off. I'm going to go like this. There we go. I'm going to do that. And then this. And then uh, chassis. Like so. I am having a little bit of fun with this design. I, You know, I do want to have a design. I know I've got a challenge that I need to meet. Ah, what I need to put in is hovers. So I might have been a bit premature with this top section. Or, ah, have I have I just messed this up? Have I messed up this mech? Have I built something fun and then... Ah, I don't know. Okay, thrusters. You can get thrusters here, definitely. Come on, yeah, cheater. Can I get double cheaters? Ooh, okay, I can, good. So let's go block there, and we're gonna go movement, and we're gonna go to the massive hovers, the tornadoes, I'm gonna go like that, good. Now this is uh, a tactic called uh, hoping that it works. <laughs> it's a tactic of mine, where you just kind of take a gamble that it will pay off, and sometimes it doesn't, so I'm gonna do that. So, there we go. I mean, that looks just disgusting, doesn't it? Do you know I'm just going to leave that out. I'm just going to leave it showing. I'm not concerned. It's fine. I might get shot in the in, in the in the hover. No one likes to get shot in the hover, so I'm going to modify my design right now. <laughs> Come on. There we go. Do this and that and that and this. And we've got a nose. We can even butt in a bit like this. And we can consider that protected. There we go. Done. And we can even do that. No. <laughs> I don't know what I'm doing with this design. I don't know how it's going to work out. I feel like more thrust is in order. Two there. Perfect. So we can have two on there. Uh, two on there. Ah, oh, now it's coming into play. Now we've got the, uh, the thrust. Uh, forward thrust I need. My cheaters need to be able to move forward as well. Feels like somewhere around here I can get a thruster on. Bingo. Cheetah, you are you are a serious looking mech. I've got I've gotta give you credit. You are beginning to look really good. It's just surprising how just a few thrusters can change things. I mean you don't seem very powerful. Right, Ford Thrust, what am I on? Seven, two, one, that's five. What I'm gonna give myself is an extended backpack so essentially just using a few error rods to create a massive amount of extra mounts for it would have been too good too good to be true if I could have got one on there oh yes there we go so we can get some thrusters there uh, I'm gonna just block in some of this because uh, I do want to be able to fight as well that is kind of sort of important can I get any blocks in here? Yes, I can. Really, what I should do is swap all of this out for error rod structure, which maybe I should do. Hmm, or not, I don't know. I don't know, I'm kind of liking what's going on. Let's do that, and let's do this. So the hovers are in an attempt to try and give it a little extra, a little extra oomph when it jumps. There we go. There's some more, okay, nothing, nothing in there. Okay, fine, nothing in there. I'm going to keep this grey though, I'm liking this grey. Can I get bits in there? Yes I can, oh good. Let's do that. Okay, uh, maybe even blocks. Good, I will do that. And this. No, that was wishful thinking, thinking I could get a block in there. Blocks in there though. Yeah, structural integrity. Uh, whoop. <laughs> and then I'll do this. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And then I can go in here and do that. I, 
could have gone one block over in, I suspect, but that's okay. So let's seal that off. Bingo, bango, bongo. I could probably fully arm this thing, but I, I kind of want to go with the challenge. So let's just mount a block on there. And I could eat. Can I even do that? Can I do that? Oh, my days, you can. Jump mech enabled. Look at that backpack. I'm 883. 883, that's fine. Now, I want to put on um, two of these squalls because I believe they will have a benefit in stabilizing this thing. So I'm going to put those on. Oh, I don't know about you, but I'm really beginning to enjoy this mech now. Okay, so can I increase the amount of thrust on the back? Probably. I could probably get some more on around the legs as well with a cunning position of these. Where are error rods? Have I got error rods selected? Yeah, I have, okay. So we know that we can go doubles with these, so. Oh, but it looks good at the moment. Oh, maybe if I could build in lots of little thrusters. Just like plow in loads of teeny, teeny thrust everywhere. <laughs> I mean, it's possible, isn't it? Surely, let's do that. Let's remove that and go here. I feel like something can get in there. Bingo. Can I get one in there as well? Yes. Which means I can do this and that. Always try and shake it up from front to back. Like don't don't just build the same front to back. You already mirrored left and right. You don't necessarily need to, I mean that is kind of ugly. I might just do that. I feel like I can squeeze something in there. There we go, yeah, four as much. I can do the same there. Bingo, okay. Hmm, this is a bit ugly. Let's do that. Yeah, let's do that, okay. Um, more thrust, maybe I could just increase the size of this backpack a little bit more to house, to sim simply put it, house a lot more thrust. So if I did that, uh, remove this and did that, and then did this, I could put that on there, like so. What does that give me? Does that give me the opportunity to do this? I mean, it gives, gives me the opportunity to go out one, but that doesn't really help me unless I'm going to curve it round, which I could. I mean, I could do this. Do I want to do that? That's too much. Don't like that. That is ugly. So let's just do that again. Uh, the thrust has gone to there. That's fine. But can I then do... I can do this. Maybe I can go like one more, like so, and then mount it there. Yeah, triple thrust, triple thrust. There we go. So, um, what's that here? Yeah, more. We can get more on. Let's just do uh, prism, prism, prism. No, it's not going to work. Hmm. Would putting helium help in the jump? If I helium up the bot, would that assist or would that be a problem? Because the legs are so heavy, I don't think it would help. I am really tempted to try and get two on here. I mean, that's doable. It just like complains about those bits. <laughs> I'm gonna do it, why not? Let's just do that. Maybe I can move this whole bit back a bit just by going. No, okay. You really don't like that, do you? You might not mind this. That's fine. Okay, good. Oh, you're an ugly creature. <laughs> right, so uh, we've got Ford Thrust. We've got uh, Thrust on the back. We've still got 500 CPU. I'm just going to have to go for it, aren't I? If I'm going to make this thing jump, I really need to just super increase the amount of thrust. So let's go to error rods to save the day. Long error rods. And let's go in somewhere around here, maybe. Okay, you're all right. 
something here would be of a persistence, I suspect. Let's see. That's just going to have to become solid blocks because we got to get the thrust on. Uh, so let's go. Boop. Is that near enough? No, it's too too close. Too close. So we'll go like that for this bit. Bang, two thrusters, which means we need to do the same here. Boop. Boop, boop. Come on, let me do it. Ah, dang it. I know what the issue is. I just need to put in one more block and then the prism. Yeah, bingo. More thrusters. So that's for... It's an awful lot of upward thrust. But I've still only just uh, scratched the surface with the amount of thrust I can have on this thing. So we really should just uh, increase it a little bit more. Let's... Uh, or should I arm it? Should I just... Maybe I should invest in some arming. Hmm. If I can do that, then I can put a block on. I can do this. <laughs> yeah! Triple thrusters! Okay, where are we on? 1,200. So, maybe we should think about adding just a little bit more weaponry on this thing. You know, just a little bit more. Nothing major, just, just a little bit. I'm gonna put on some turning thrust as well. I don't know if turning thrust helps with mechs. I'm not sure if it does, but in the in the possibility that it does help, I'm just gonna uh, modify my design. What? No. <laughs> Let's just put on some more. Uh, Let's just go. Let's just go like that. No, yeah, like that. And go like this. There we go. And let's just put on. Let's just see where I can add some. Like there, for example, and there, um, and in here maybe. And no, but maybe in here somewhere. No. There must be somewhere I can squeeze in some more thrusters. Mm. Maybe here. Who's at the door? <laughs> Hello. <laughs> uh, ah, okay, we can get one there. Uh, and that means I can definitely put something there as well. Well, we're on 1465. Um, uh, I think we might be there. That might be a. Mm, I still got some CPU. Maybe I could put those on. No, that impacts too much on the design. Uh, make that a block. And then that a prism. Ooh. Bang. We can go like that. Uh, put a prism there. And then if we put on uh, Tetras. In here just to complete the look mm, no. like this there we go now what I can do as a result is I can put in a thruster there and I can also add which might just be the final thrusters yeah there we have it that's it so let's move those back a little bit like so and then just prism in front of those, like so, no, like so, and there we have it, that's the mech, jump, oh, do you know what? I can put on two more prisms somewhere and just, and then that will be max CPU, bang, there we have it, jump mech, build took a little longer than we thought, but there we have it, I don't know if it will jump, or how high it will jump, altometer, we need this altometer, that's what we need. Let's put that on somewhere. Maybe on here? No. Maybe here? Dang it. Didn't think of Altometer. Uh, X. Damn it. I hope it's one CPU for this thing. Otherwise, I am in troubles. Okay. Altometer. Speedometer. There. 
Okay, so it seems that they're two CPU each. Okay, they should be. Oh no, I just didn't have mirror mode on. Okay, that's fine. Uh, speedometer. Great. So I can. They're in the right place. Yep. I can record things. Maybe I shouldn't have them so exposed. I should just change this to that and put them there. Hmm. Let's uh, do that actually. So speedometer. Uh, that should be altometer. It is. Ah, good. It came out on there. Like that. Okay, good. Now, there we have it. That's the back. Ivan table. Ah, oh, no colors. <laughs> Just forgetting everything. Uh, colors. Great. I mean, gray looks good. But I want to do something with the glass. Let's have, uh, let's have the yellow glass. There we go. Um, black? Black on the thrusters? Yeah, black on the thrusters. Okay, let's go black. Black on the pl plasmas. Dang it. So I need to re squirt everything that I squirted originally. So that's those and those. Do you know what? Let's just, just do that. Okay. Legs. Yep. What's black glass look like? Hmm, looks pretty good. There we go, okay. So just a little splish blush, there we go. Black thrusters, black legs, little black in there. We do need to do a little highlight, so let's go yellow and do this front section, just yellow, like so. There we go. Uh, blue, boop, 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 boop. Uh, I guess. <laughs> Novik says, danger like a yellow stripe down the front. And then maybe go out like this. Bingo, that's the mech. Jump mech done. Ivy Tail, thanks so much for watching. Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe, and I will see you again soon in another video. In the meantime, take care of yourself. Stay chummy. Don't forget. <laughs>